Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I am 25 weeks pregnant. Um, I figured I would do another car update just because I'm on my way to work and I really didn't want to have to upload tomorrow. I wanted to do it today. So, symptoms this week. Feeling pretty good except uh, my feet are constantly hurting all the time. I feel like, I mean it has been busy, but I'm getting to the point where being on my feet all day is definitely catching up to me. I did get like a mat at work so I can stand on, but that really doesn't help. Um, leg cramps definitely are getting worse, but drinking more water, and I do notice a big difference with drinking a lot more water. Because the last two nights I have not woken up with any leg cramps. So I'm trying to just drink more. Another symptom I have, I've said it a couple, a couple videos ago, is that I'm already having colostrum. So the other night I was laying in bed with my husband and the right side of my shirt was wet. So I'm like, oh, what is that from? And I realized it's the colostrum leaking through my shirt. It was a pretty big wet spot. And my breasts have definitely been very tender and they feel extra swollen. Another thing this week is I do have a doctor's appointment tomorrow. So I'm gonna see how my weight gain and everything else is going. The one thing I've definitely been starting to think about is when I go on maternity leave, it's really been stressing me out maternity leave I would get they, I don't they don't offer it through my job so I'll go on disability the only thing with that is disability only pays you about 50% of your wages so and I make a lot in tips as well so that really isn't much so um, I'm definitely I, I, I don't I don't want to come back to work and be and stress about all the bills piling up and put all those bills on my husband so I have been checking out other options. I am trying to take out a personal loan. So I'm going to see how that goes. Because if I get the personal loan, then I can pay all my bills on time. And I could actually take the full six weeks. Because as of right now, if I don't have a backup plan, I'm most likely only going to be taking four weeks. And I know after you give birth even six weeks isn't long enough so I am just trying to look at all my options here older sister also is starting to plan my baby shower like I said it's for September 9th I went with her because I always have some input with it so um she picked up all the decorations I'm like so excited everything's gonna be cute my mother-in-law is helping her with it but I'm very excited for my baby shower. I'm excited just to see everybody and get lots of little presents for little baby Evie. I have been taking a lot of naps. That has not changed. Um, I believe third trimester starts when you're like 28 weeks. I could be wrong, but I'm hoping that they say like a lot of your first trimester symptoms will come back in the third and as miserable as I was I really am praying that they do not come back um another symptom this week is not even so much a symptom is pretty much almost every one of baby Evie's cakes I can see from the outside I do have a video of it a little bit but by the time I pulled the camera out she was still moving but I miss some of the big, powerful kicks. But I will definitely just see my stomach start bulging out. And I don't remember seeing my son's kicks from the outside where at 25 weeks. I could be wrong. I'm going to have to like look at my baby book and definitely check on that. But... I love that she's still a very active baby she's still always on the move um, another thing within the last like two weeks I would say 
almost every single night I wake up at maybe like quarter to five in the morning every single night I look I go to the bathroom I wake up I wonder what time it is and I look and of course it's like the same exact time every day so that's kind of I'm wondering if maybe that's when she's gonna be up for one of her feedings or who knows stomach has definitely popped when I look down at it it definitely looks like I swallowed like a little basketball it's like really cute belly now um, I have no new stretch marks as of yet I'm kind of hoping I won't get any new stretch marks just because I'm already I already have so many for my son that the skin's already so stretched that I don't see why I would get any more so we will see I think that's all for this week though I like I said I am on my way to work I have a doctor's appointment tomorrow so I will update you guys all next week on how that went but I mean I guess I'll just show you my belly posting a baby clothes haul um, I did do a lot of shopping for her I'm kind of done at this point I just want to see what I'm gonna get for the baby shower but I am going to be doing a baby haul of only the stuff I bought not so much the stuff that was given to me just the stuff that I bought and I'm also another video coming up is I'm, I'm going to be doing a back-to-school haul for my son and everything that we bought him as well. Stay tuned for those two videos. Thank you guys so much for watching. Really appreciate it. Like I said, hit that subscribe button. Please hit the like button. And I will update you guys all again next week. Thank you guys so much. Bye.